Hello everyone and welcome back to Octopath Traveler 2. My name is Maxos and our goal today ladies and gentlemen is going to be to make a ton of money. Why? We're going to complete Descent of Commerce quest. Well, I did have some cues out on how to complete that. We did find Masood's daughter last time. I did find a musician, actually two of them. So I guess we're going to have to find the third one and money wise. I think we have 100k, right? Yeah, so we got plenty of leads. And now we're ready for business. So I hope you guys are ready with me. Because we're going to go on our journey to actually complete all those scent of, uh, scent of merchandise. The scent of commerce. Yeah. Do you smell money, guys? So do I. Mmm, and it smells great. Yeah. <laughs> so let's go for it. So first and foremost, we're going to... Talk to the lady right here. That was the daughter of uh, Masood that we learned from last time. My father taught me that we should all treasure ourselves. Oh, that's pretty good. You gotta bet it's gonna be her. All right. Uh, oh, we gotta be in the night to hire her. All right, bro, old lady, you've been quite a help, but now you can go back to your business. And I'm gonna hire Masood's daughter. Oh, yeah, let's do it. So we're going to have to recruit her again, because uh, as you can see, we received 10% of uh, purchases, which is pretty good. Nice oh, yeah. All right, I'll follow you. And by the way, guys, if you do like those videos, don't forget to give it a like. And if you want to see more and want to help the channel, please support us by subbing. And thank you very much. And let's go meet Masood. So we got your daughter, brother. What about that? We got your answer. As promised, I brought you your treasure, Masood. You did, did you? Show me. Your greatest treasure is her, your daughter. Uh. Hmm. For me, it is my family. That's right. Incorrect. What? Try again. What? What? It is true that many value their family above any jewel or gem. But that is not the answer that I am seeking for this particular test. Oh. Better luck next time. Oh. All right. <sighs> oh. Oh, oh, oh. I was sure I had it. What is this test that father gave you? Huh? Uh, oh, uh... Find the best treasure in the world. Ah. What father meant wasn't his treasure in particular, but what a merchant treasures most. Oh. The thing you treasure most as a merchant isn't leaves or sundries, right? Nope. A merchant's treasure. Oh, I got it. <laughs> That's all the hints you'll get from me. Good luck. I got it. That's the businessman itself. It's what you have. You, yourself, right? What do I treasure as a merchant? Like she said, not leaves or sundries. That's You're the businessman itself. Come on, buddy. That's it. Oh. My greatest treasure is me. Yeah! <laughs> In which case, Masood must feel the same way, too. It's worth a shot, anyhow. Because you are your own market. You are the one who makes your own business. Oh, that's pretty cool. All right, let's go back and see him. Oh, I love that. Because <laughs> family it's, it's, is important for you, but as a merchant itself, you are the own business. You are your own ad network. You are what you actually create. That's pretty cool. All right. Uh, how do I bring? Oh, I have an idea. Let's buy him. Well, hire him. Oh, wait, what? 20% of purchases? Oh my God, I'm still gonna recruit him. Oh yeah, let's hire him. Yeah. You wanna hire me? What is the meaning of this insult, Mr. Nobody? I think we got it, guys. I figured out your treasure, fella. It's you, yourself. 
I think you we got asked it. me to find the treasure you value most as a merchant. I figure every merchant's got one treasure they set store by above all else. Connections they built, book learning and experience. Yeah. All these things are far more valuable than any material object, leaves included. Or am I wrong? Just before you continue, yeah, you build yourself and then out of what you build, this is how you make money and how you generate revenues. So that's pretty good. Good job, Partisha. Let's follow up. Hmm. Correct. I'm surprised you got it. Yeah, good job. <laughs> of course I did. My greatest treasure is the same as yours, after all. Besides, your daughter gave me a friendly push in the right direction. I couldn't find the answer after all that, I'd have no right to call myself a merchant. I am honestly astonished that there are still merchants in this world who know how to see to the heart of matters. Aww. There have been dozens like you who have come here seeking my mercantile manuscript. <gasps> Do we have access to it? Every one of them failed this test and went home empty-handed. I started to think the world had gone dull since I retired. Oh. Here. Take it. Yeah, let's go! What's this? The key to the archive in which I placed my mercantile manuscript. Oh. Read to your heart's content. It's just not only one book? Yippee! Y you sure it's all right? I've grown old. I don't have much time left. Share your wisdom. That's pretty good. When I pass, so too will my greatest treasure. Correct? Yeah. So I might as well pass on a part of that treasure to you, Particio the Merchant. The sum treasure of those who came before you. Ooh. <laughs> you got it, fella. Thank you. I feel like I should complete the books I'm writing, right? <laughs> Sharing wisdom of what you learn is actually really important. Because you have a limit of time, so you can share it to the next to the next generation. Yeah, that's pretty cool. The Mercantile Manuscript. You can now pursue the man a Mercantile Manuscript in the archive. The records are full of information, documents by Masood. You never know what knowledge you might glean. Alright. So we can end. Oh, we can... <gasps> No way. Hold on. Whoa, there is a lot of stuff. Can I read? All the humans possess a certain modicum of intelligence. For example, Radkin are known to steal and employ humanity. Wait a minute. Hold on. There is a lot of stuff. Can I read all of those? Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. All right. Wait, wait, hold on. So those are... Weaponsmith, battle tested, all right. Those are history of items. Oh my God, there is so much stuff. Do you mean, yeah, all right, all right, all right. So what I'm gonna do, <laughs> I'm not gonna read that right now. There's too much stuff, but what we're gonna do is pretty simple. Oh my God, yeah. History of every single city. Auto content, yeah, all right. So <laughs> pretty simple. I'm not gonna read them right now, but there is a lot of stuff. So what I'll do is, of videos, I will read all of that. And what is important in that, I will share it with you. Well, well, not what is important, but what I feel is most important, I will read it and share it with you guys. But yeah, I, I did actually write a book already and I'm working on a second and third one. And uh, it's gonna be for video games. And uh, tips and tricks. Well, I'm doing some mentoring as well in real life. So coaching people on how to actually better themselves. That's what I do. And also I'm an analyst in, uh, in programming. So yeah. Yeah, I mean, I, I, I work in computer science. But I'm also a mentor as a uh, do a mentoring as a job. So that's pretty cool. But it, it's in French. So it's harder for me to explain in English. But you get the idea. <laughs> so that's why I'm working on a book. And uh, I actually, it's pretty close on completion, but it's in French right now. I need to translate it, so it's going to be quite a while of work. But yeah, there we go. All right, so we did complete the Masood quest. I will hire him, but right now, I mean, 
I feel like we're gonna have to hire more people, especially that we needed some for music, I guess. So what I'm gonna do later on, I'll come back to him. Oh, 10k? All right, it's gonna be worth it. Receive 20% of purchases. It's gonna be quite effective. So what we're gonna do, pretty simple. Um, it was in Winter Bloom, right? Yeah, I think it was in Winter Bloom. Let's go back and let's check out uh, more infos. Can we inquire more info from the guy who wanted to do phonographic stuff music? Uh, I, I mean, he wanted to record some music, so let's go meet him. He might give us some tips on how to fix it. Uh, it was just a random log that we found Mesut's daughter last episode when we did Cassie's episode, the second chapter, and we just happened to fall on her. So yeah, that was pretty cool. All right, uh, be sure to visit once you are a musician. Yeah, in need of guidance on where to look. Huh? I know there was one in Kindle Brian that was playing the violin, but the other ones, I'm not sure. Uh, oh, oh, all right. <laughs> Flame Church, Crack Ridge, and Kindle Brian. Oh yeah, Crackridge, there was a musician there, uh, there was a guitar player. So, uh, let's go for Crackbridge first, alright. Let's go for Crackbridge, uh, that was right here, correct? Yeah, oh, Crackridge, sorry. There you go. Alright, let's go for it. So we need to hire every single musician and bring him back to this guy. Oh, there he is, look at that. Told you. Can we inquire him? Hello, sir. Ooh, head and item. An unsuccessful guitarist who left the village or dream of fames. Uh, despite being a skilled musician, he has yet to get his lucky break. Well, should we get him a good break? Thank you, Thank you good sir. And we got an item out of that. Oh, we cannot hire him. Uh, in the night? Oh, he's not there. All right, let me get the item. Silver sheet. shield. Oh, cool. Uh, oh, wait, he's right here. <laughs> <laughs> cool. Can I hire you? 5k, uh, 2k. All right, let's do this. Want to follow us, buddy? All right. My handsome strength is in my hand. Ends your ends in your hands. All right, cool. But he can do music. Oh, listen to the song. That was the song he was playing, but in nighttime. Oh, that's pretty cool. All right, let's go back to Winterbloom. And let's go meet our friend who needed some musicians. Are we gonna do an album? Oh yeah! The Rocky Songs of Octopath Traveler 2, now in discs. <laughs> oh yeah, let's do it. The Sand of Commerce, I love that. So, uh, can you talk? Oh, Particio, yeah. you brought a musician for me. Hell yeah, that's one of them. Preparations have been finished. Let's record. Cool. Oh, yeah. Woo -hee. Ah, what a calming melody. The guitar's tranquil notes match that sprightly melody better than I had imagined they would. I'm sure this piece will ease many a troubled heart. Isn't that the song from the battles? Da, la, da, 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 la, right. da, yeah, it I is. Two more to go. <laughs> I'll need to keep my eye out for another musician to bring by. All right, cool. Well, we can go in uh, Kano Brian because we know there is a violinist right there. So let's go to Kano Brian. Uh, that was right here, right? Yeah, Kano Brian. There we go. Awesome, awesome. Are we gonna have it? Yeah, if we do an album out of that, that's gonna be pretty damn cool. Oh, there she is. So in the day, you don't see her, but I remembered in the night, I did see her. And yeah, as you can see, I already, oh, <clears throat> I mugged her. I I'm sorry, I mugged a violinist. <laughs> Oopsie. <laughs> so I got her items, <laughs> but now we're gonna hire you. Oh, look at that, puppy dog eyes. You earn 15 to 30 more percent of sales. So, oh my god. So, <laughs> so when I will hire someone <laughs> just to sell items, I come back to this, this violinist unless I get better. But nah, she's 15 to 30 percent. That's pretty damn good. Let's get to work. Oh, I see you're in need. Allow me to help. Oh, yeah. We're gonna make more money, guys. Let's go back to Winterbloom. 
But I'm still wondering about the boat. I, I mean, we can buy it, she didn't want to sell it, but... Uh, I just hope we don't get uh, scammed out of that, because 100,000k? Yeah. Well, uh, not 100,000k, 100,000 is pretty much a lot, yeah. Well, we did farm quite a lot, I mean, we have it, but it was quite expensive, a lot of farming. And selling some items, I, I know that selling items, that was, yeah, pretty oh, Marticio, good. you brought a musician for me. Yeah, another one. The preparations have been finished. Let's record. Come on, shake it. Oh yeah. Fantastic. Sometimes soft, sometimes strong. The sweet sounds of sultry strings soothe my soul. This violin piece is indeed worth revisiting time and time again. This is the song when All we right. meet strange Only animals. More to go. I'll need to keep my eye out for another musician to bring by. Alrighty then. So we need one more. That was Flame Church. Oh, there it is. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was the church show. Yeah, right here. All right. So let's try to first find a musician. I don't remember seeing one when I was with Temenos here. All right, uh, let's go into the day first. Uh, where could we see a musician? In here? Nope. All right. No. Well, we can inquire. Might as well do it. Yeah, I'm not going to buy it. I'm going to steal you. Let's inquire first. Uh, she's not a musician. All right. Thank you. Goodbye. <laughs> what about you, sir? It's a soldier. Probably not. Oh, this guy at the end. I uh, keep safe and by vigilant. Yeah. All right. Thank you. There's nothing special, but we have discounts. That's pretty cool. <laughs> not that we really need them, but are you a musician? Young artist. Oh, cool. Uh, the son of a wealthy family and aspiring painter. Oh, no. Painter. Oh. Alright. Well, that's pretty cool, though. If we need a painter later on... That was very helpful. Take good notes. Alright. Hello, lady. What about you? A uh, woman born and raised. Her husband claimed to have fallen in love with her. Ordinariness. Uh, sharing interests. Oh, in the painter. Oh, 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 oh. That was oh, very yeah. Ha, <laughs> ha, all right, so it's not here. Uh, let me check here. Oh, the item first. Yeah, might as well grab it. Yoink! Oops, eep, oop, oop. There we go. Thank you. What about here? Nope. Item shop? Nope. I cannot interact with him, so what about you? Elderman. Uh, old man, quick to greet everyone with a friendly word. Uh... Oh, he was a skilled assassin. Ooh, nice. I love that. Love that. All right. Like and love at the same time? Yeah. <laughs> All right. Uh, oh, that's an apothecary, so it's, it's not a musician. All right. Let's get in the day. That was very helpful. Thank you. And we found an Indian item. Awesome. What about here? Hello, sir. Are you a musician? Townsperson. Uh, again, artisan like other. This man lost his job through unfortunate combination of poor and luck injury. All right, the latter eventually healed, but his will to work never recovered, and his wife has since given up on him. Oh, each day feels worse. Oh, I feel sorry for him. That was very sorry, buddy. Oh my God, that sucks. That sucks. I feel sorry. Yeah, be there for each other. That's pretty cool. What about you? Hello, a resident of Flame Church who serve as a courier. All right, he's a messenger. All right. Uh, oh, oh, his sister is named Mint. Oh, we know Mint. Thank you. <laughs> so he's a, it's Mint's brother. All right. <laughs> yes, he doesn't have a name. Street vendor, so probably not him. All right, someone visit in town at night. He gaze towards the heaven and count every last shooting star. Oh, that's pretty cool. <laughs> that was very but helpful. that's not him. All right. Crap. Where are they? What about you, sir? 
Elder. Back in my days, I served the Order of the Sacred Flame and its pilgrims as well. But I do not play music. I'm sorry. Elder at 52? Come on. Thank you. Not that old, buddy. Got plenty of time. Not here? What about here? Uh, is it mint? Or is it someone else? No, it's just a cleric. All right. Um, she was an anointed cleric at a young age. I uh, uh, was at seven children. Ooh. So she, she no. Where is she? That was very or he? Hard. Where's the music player? Oh, right, an item. Ooh, hello. A feather dad. Cool. Oh, obviously the organ or the piano. Hello, lady. Piano playing cleric. Yep, yep. All right, we found it. A piano prodigy who began practicing at a young age, long before she became a cleric. Despite her calm and gentle mannerism, she plays the piano with warmth and passion. Her regular church recitals always draw large crowds. All right, you got a deal. All right, let's check mint first. Might as well check everyone, since we're here. A cleric of bl uh, blessing, a sacred flame to reach every corner of the realm. Aww, she always have a smile on her face. Aww. That was very helpful. All right. Uh oh, wait, that's right. Nighttime. Oh. Oh no. Where is she? Uh, are you? No, the cleric. All right. Uh. Ah, piano playing cleric. I believe music heals people's heart and minds just as well as the sacred flame itself. Oops, that's not what I meant. There you go. That's what I wanted. Yeah. Wanna have a job? I've got something for you. Let's go for it. Let's work up a nice sweat. I'll gladly follow if you think I'd be of help. Oh yeah, you will. Let's go back to Winterbloom. <laughs> oh yeah, we got the musicians. Let's go for it. So now that we got our three magi uh, not magicians, I'm sorry, musicians, uh, what do we get out of that? Because it is said that the Sand of Commerce, you get good stuff out of that, so I'm curious. All right, hello, buddy. Oh, Particio, you brought a musician for me. That's right. The preparations have been finished. Let's record. All right, let's do it. Oh, yeah. Bravo! Bravo! I've never heard such a passionate piano piece. I've listened to piano performances the world over, but never one so emotional, so moving. Yeah! Nice. Thank you so much. You're welcome, Audley. Equipped with a marvelous selection of songs, this device is now a truly marketable product. Strategically, I think it would be wise to sell it to the wealthy nobles and elite first. Oh yeah. Now hold up there, fella. Why limit your consumer base? Let all sorts of folks enjoy your product. Ooh. For example, hmm place where all sorts can experience this thing oh how about putting one in taverns all across the land karaoke <laughs> taverns are you sure <laughs> that'd be cool larger establishments could afford it certainly but it's too costly for your average local tap room then why not cut out the recording part just sell the sound maker doohickey on the cheap Ooh. That's a brilliant idea. So people can listen to music and we can record it wise. Leap at the prospect of easy access to song, whether it's a hometown ditty or a romantic croon. You bet your buttons customers would pour into any tavern sport one of these contraptions. <laughs> I can use that for my sales pitch, certainly. Hell yeah. Of course, once one of these is in taverns around the world, individuals will want one for themselves too, I reckon. Party shoes wise. If the band gets high enough, 
mass production and mass profit ain't just a dream. Picture this, fella. A world in which every household has their own personal music machine. Ooh. That future may just be around the corner. What a fantastic notion. Particio, I am so very glad our paths crossed. <laughs> oh, yes. If you're willing, I'd like to give you the honor of naming this product. Oh, oh, I have an idea. A name, huh? Playing it straight with music recorder ain't got no style. We call it gramophone because it's exactly that. Phonogramics, kind of hard to say. Uh, how about we switch it around and call it <laughs> gramophone? <laughs> exactly. Gramophone? Oh my yes. god. Yes, I love it. <laughs> now off I go to sell it in every corner oh, of the world. Oh, that's so realm. cool. That's so cool. They plugged a gramophone. Good luck, fella. I can't wait to hear it playing in a tavern near me. Wait, can we use it? Really? Can we? Obtain Kate's theme, piano version, guitar version, and violin version. The gramophone. You can now play records on the gramophone in taverns. <gasps> really? Select a record to play music in that tavern. Oh, you can obtain more records from shop and townspeople. Oh my god! I will have to run around the whole... Oh my god, I can go everywhere and get more teams? Oh, that's so cool. Thank you, Oddly. Oh my god, this is awesome. <laughs> this is so cool. All right. All right. Let's go to the tavern, guys. Oh my god. So I will have to talk to more people now and I might get songs. Oh, that is cool. And from shops as well. Let, let me check the shop. No. Well, yeah, yeah. All right. Let's check the shop. Any songs? No. All right. That's fine. Gramophone time. Gramophone time. Yeah. Oh, look at that. There it is. <laughs> it works. Oh my god, there is a lot of songs. So that's another uh, unlock that we need to continue. Oh, that's so cool. I'm totally gonna do that. All right, so we have... Oh. And when we leave... The music stops. Oh. <laughs> All right. Oh, that's so cool. All right, quick save right here. And now there's another set of commerce we need to do. So, now that we have a gramophone in every tavern, we can unlock new songs, I guess. And uh, we have access to the archive from Sai, well, from the uh, manuscript. So, uh, now it's up to uh, Tropuhopu, I think. Yeah, Tropuhopu. And there was a boat we wanted to buy. Oh, wait a minute. No, I have an idea. Oh, I have an idea. <laughs> Let's go back to Sai just for a few minutes. Well, not even minutes, just one minute, maybe. <laughs> Remember, we talked to Masood and he gave us the archive key, but we can hire him, right? And I did, I, I still do have the lady from the piano, but I feel like, oh, might as well inquire. It was a fame. Oh, I, I think Masood was in the first game. Yeah, it was. Oh my God, that is so cool. All right. Uh, no, let's switch to night mode. Can I hire you again? Oh yeah, oh yeah, totally. And we have plenty of cash. All right, we'll receive 20% off purchases. <laughs> Is it gonna work? Let's do it. Oh, Panacea as well. So it's gonna cleanse us. Never thought I'd hit the road again at this edge. Yeah, all right. So remember guys, I will go back in here and read stuff and share it with you. But now, now it is time. Now it is time to uh, go to Tropu Apu and actually buy the boat. Can we? Wait a minute, can we use it? Oh, that'd be so cool, but... I don't know, I don't know, maybe, maybe, let's do it. Come on! <laughs> uh, we can purchase on daytime, I guess. All right, Tropuopu Shipyard. Because I know we could buy the boat, but she didn't want to sell it, but maybe it was part of the Sand of Commerce quest, so maybe there's something. Let's check it out. 
<gasps> we can buy the unfinished vessel. Oh, yeah, we can. So we probably can aggle 20%. Uh, let's go Terry. A shipwright who's inherited her grandfather's shipyard. Her parents are both traveling scholars. So they spend most of her time, uh, young life, around her grandfather. Oh, all right. She grew uh, conscient after mastering the fundamentals of shipbuilding at 14, but has since been humbled by the realization that her grandfather was truly a master of his craft. Cool. All right. Well, uh, if I talk to you, the vessel costs a hundred thousand leaves. If you want it, you'll have to bring me the money in full. All right, we got the money. Uh, let me buy it. Am I going to be able to haggle this? Because it's going to be 20k. That's pretty much a lot. A vessel made by the apprentice of a legendary shipwright. Called the miserable vessel by some... Oh. Let's do it anyway. I smell business. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go! 20k! Thank you, Masood! A hundred thousand leaves? Wait, does this mean... Hell yeah! You betcha! I wanna buy that ship of yours! Yeah! I get it now. You're just another one of them. What? Huh? You only want it because you heard the rumors, right? Which rumors? that my vessel is the last work of my master, the legendary shipwright. No? Sorry to disappoint you, but it wasn't my master who designed this ship. So what? I want the ship. <laughs> it was me. I bought it now. It's mine. Uh, your point? I'm trying to tell you that it's worthless, unsaleable, just the brainchild of a mere disciple. I don't care. I want the ship. Everyone I've told that to has, to date, immediately stomped off in a huff. Well, I don't much care who designed your ship, man. Truth is, I fell in love the second I saw her. Oh, yeah. There's even a seahorse. Even though she's incomplete? Yeah. You're no shipwright. You've got no reason to appreciate her. <laughs> you got me dead to rights. I couldn't tell stem from stern. But I know a deal when I smell one. <laughs> and my merchant's intuition is hollering at me to buy, buy, buy. Oh, yeah. You're willing to gamble that much money on a mere hunch? Yep. <laughs> when I was just a chickadee, I practiced my appraisal skills by watching silversmiths day in and day out. I learned how to recognize well-maintained tools, despite the patina of wear and tear. How to see the calluses on artisans' hands is proof of their dedication and talent. That's right. I can see the same spirit and skill in you, man. You're a first-class artisan, or my name ain't Particio. <laughs> That's why I'm sure that any tub you make gonna turn out sensation and that's right by the way take care of your You're tools the first person who's ever complimented these shop worn hands of mine well they say a true masterwork is imbued with the spirit a voice can you hear it now This ship is awesome! I'm raring to gallop across the ocean waves faster than a frisky stallion. That's what your vessel show. Hell yeah, looks badass. <laughs> so please, sell me this fine ship of yours. No, I already told you, it isn't for sale. But. What about my money? Oh, shucks. Not yet, anyway. Mind waiting until I've made it something worth selling? Oh, yeah! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hello? Of course. From here on out, I'm going to work like a woman possessed to finish this ship. Ooh. It'll take some time, of course. Will you wait for me? Yes. You bet your hat I will. Oh, yeah. Then it's settled. I'll use this money to buy the materials I need and hire a team of skilled shipwrights to assist me. You got it, Terry. I'm not for that. I never thought I'd see the day I could finally set out to complete her. 
Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Are we going to get a boat? I'm on a boat. Yeah. Go, team. Oh, yeah. Look at them go. <laughs> I'm getting ready for business. That is so cool. That money will, was well invested. I'm so glad about it. <laughs> so, Terry, how is it? My master praised me for the first time when I showed him the blueprints I drew up for this ship. Ooh. He told me, now I can finally retire with my head held high. <laughs> he must have cared deeply for you. Building this was the final major job he set out to do. Ooh. But he collapsed soon after oh. we finished the hole. Oh. After that, our financiers scattered like a swarm of little spiders. They mumbled platitudes like the future is steamships as they went. The truth is, they didn't think a mere apprentice's ships would sell. My master's other apprentices started slipping away soon too. One after the other. It was ridiculous. Infuriating. Soon, I just gave up making ships altogether. Never give up on your dreams, remember. Once people get a whiff of this beauty, the investors will stampede back here like a herd of cattle. <laughs> yeah! I hope so. You're gonna be able to build a lot of ships with us. But even if they don't, I'll keep on practicing my craft. There are people out there who will appreciate me and my works for what they are. Like you, Particio. Nice. Now then, all that's left is to give her hull a fresh coat of paint and sew a sigil into her sails. Ooh. I'm ready to go. Any particular requests? What do you mean? Am I gonna... <gasps> I can choose the color and the... Oh! <laughs> All right, let's try the colors. Uh, let's try the black color. Ooh, nice. What about the red one? Ooh. And there's the blue one? I want to try it out. Oh! Mmm, that's not an easy, easy choice. Uh, black was pretty damn cool. But blue, uh, looks fantastic. I'll go with blue, I think, yeah. Yeah, let's go with blue. I like that. And what about a symbol? A uh, sun emblem? Oh, look at the top! What about a uh, trident of the sea god? Oh, yeah! Is there a pirate ship? Um, symbol? Octopus? Oh, no! <laughs> uh, I will go with the trident of the sea god, I think. Yeah! Yeah! Sail the seas! Oh, yeah! Place order! Is this what you want? Ship color blue. And the trident of the sea god. Yeah! Let's roam the oh, sea! That's perfect! Thank you, Ethery. Oh, yeah. Are we gonna be able to sail with it? For real? No. Did I get myself a mount? <laughs> there. She's all finished. Can we open? Oh, she's even more beautiful than I'd dreamed that's she'd be. That's awesome! She's yours now, Particio. Go on. Give her a name. Uh. A name, huh? Let me see. Uh-oh. Do I have a choice? Because I have no idea right now. Got it. From this day forward, I dub her the Grand Terry. Oh, yeah! Wh is it... What? <laughs> Let's go! She may be my ship, but she's got your soul. Oh, uh, you're so cool, Partition. That's why I gave her your name, Terry. Here's hoping she's the first of many of her kind. Huh. This is a first <laughs> for me. I'm not really sure what to say. That's so cool. Go and cast off already, you rogue. Let her see the world. Yeah, are we gonna use a boat for real? You got it. Thanks, Terry. I'll be sure to treat her right. We're gonna use the Grand Terry. Oh my god. Are we really? Oh my god, the music changed. Oh my god, I've got chills. Come on. 
Are we on the sea? Oh my god! Yes! <laughs> you can now take your boat from Anchorage for from Oh, the realm of her. Oh my god, embark on adventures in the sea and you may find Uncharted Island and discover new creatures. Oh my god! <laughs> really? <laughs> Let's go! We can sail! Oh my god! Uh, oh, there's... Ooh, a chest! Let me try it out. Oh, that's so cool! <laughs> Fortune win! Oh! Oh, an, an island! An island! We can disembark? No way! So I can... Oh my god, that is so cool! <laughs> nice! I can use the boat any, anywhere I want. Oh, new island! Oh, there's a dungeon here. All right. Oh my god, guys. That means there is so much more to uncover. Oh! <laughs> this is so cool. Oh, another chest. Ooh, so... Oh, there's a whirlpool! Oh my god. Uh, mm, no? I, I don't want to go there yet. Look at that! Yeah, let's go here. It's New Delta. Oh, that's right. That's right. So we can disembark wherever we want? Oh my god. So there's new dungeons to uncover just by traveling with that? Oh my god. Yes! <laughs> that is so cool! That was totally worth it. Oh my god. <laughs> Yes! We got a boat! <laughs> so we finally got a Grand Terry. Oh, that... I did not expect that, guys. This is so cool. Oh my god, we're gonna have to explore the world with the boat as well. This is gonna be a great adventure, guys. And we're not even done with Chapter 2. Oh, wow. I love it! And I hope you guys did enjoy it as well. Uh, next time, I might follow up on the story of Oswald. But uh, we might go for chapter 2 of uh, probably Casty here. Yeah, chapter 2 for Casty. And there's Oshet as well. Oh, we need, yeah, 37 though. Oh, God. But maybe not this one. So we might go for Oswald. And we might do the shared uh, cross path as well. But there we go. Oh, my God. That is so cool. We can use a boat now. Oh, yeah. Look, there's an dungeon here. The Nameless Isle. Oh, yeah. Oh, there's so much to uncover. You can bet on it, guys. I'm going to explore everything. But it's going to be in the next episodes of Octopath Traveler 2. <laughs> yeah! So if you guys enjoyed the video and want to see more, don't forget to give it a like. And if you want to see more videos and support the channel, please subscribe. And thank you very much. And on those words, guys, I wish you an awesome day. Oh, yeah! See you soon for more adventures of Octopath Traveler 2. Have a good one. <laughs>